Hi, in this video, I will show you how to draw grid lines in ETAB. So here is the grid lines A, B, C, the distance between them 15 feet and 15 feet. And in the X direction, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, and distances are 10 feet, 10 feet, 10 feet. And you can change uh, according to your requirement. So now in the ETAB, I will start from scratch file, I uh, mean from new model. So I will use, there are three unit system. So I will use built in setting with US customary system. Here there is also metric, metric MTS. So I am using US customary unit system. So these are all the settings which I will discuss later okay so basically i will draw the grid lines by uh, by myself manually not the pre-planned by the uh, the e-tabs so here i have clicked blank document blank file okay okay now i will go in the edit edit stories and grid system here is a default g1 i will click it modify and you can delete and click on add new so these you can play with these settings here i am clicking modify in that there is no grid lines in the x data and the y data so i will create the grid lines in the x and in the y data so here i have clicked so you can uh, draw grids the whichever method uh, is suit to you so here display grid data as ordinates display grid data as spacing so I am uh, basically feel easy to play with display grid data as spacing here add for example I am naming a sorry that is x1 one two three four so that's why I am naming one there is two there is three there is four so the first is 10 feet second one is also 10 feet third one is also 10 feet and the distance between third and four is also 10 feet so let me check uh, there is a five so I will draw one more grid here and again set the spacing 10 feet. So you can also uh, check or uncheck these uh, whether you want to see the uh, grid lines on your model. So here visible no or yes and and I will also discuss what are these and at start at both ends or none. So now I will move in the Y grid data. I will uh, draw three grid lines A, B, C. First one is A, second one is B, B, third one is C. So I will put the spacing 15 feet between A and B. Between B and C, the spacing is also 15 feet. So now you can also see the same grid I have generated as, as I have already drawn in the AutoCAD. So here is the bubble size. You can also adjust uh, the bubble size. Uh, for example, I am making it small. This is 14 inch. So you can adjust according to your requirement or your visibility. So for example, in the display, here is the basically X ordinate and Y ordinate. That is the zero zero means the global X and Y. If you change here three, and three then you have to also uh, set the grid uh, origin as as per your requirement you can change the grid origin as per your requirement so uh, about the reference point reference planes and the general grids I will discuss in the next lectures 
okay so let's see is it creating uh, will it create uh, e tabs the grid okay so now you can see a b c 15 feet 15 feet 10 feet 10 feet 10 feet 10 feet and x and y at the 00 location so that's all thank you